Yo guys, so I don't even know if you could hear me right now. I'm stopped in the middle of the freeway and it's pretty loud right now. So I don't know if you guys could hear me. It's really windy. It's really windy right now. Um, it's windy. I'm standing here in the middle of the freeway. It just stopped raining over here. Something very unfortunate just happened. I just got in a car crash. I just got in a car accident right now. Look at it guys, this was pretty bad. I literally just got in a car crash. Let me show you guys the damage. This is my first car accident ever in my life. I don't know if you guys can see, but there's a big old dent. I feel like you guys can see it. There's just like a huge dent right in the middle of the car, right there. Yeah. Yeah, so the car accident was pretty hard. It was pretty bad. So I was um, I was on my way to go play basketball. See, I got my, obviously my gym outfit. I got my Nike gym bag. I woke up really early to go play basketball. I was uh, driving on my way to the gym. And as you could see, you know, from my uh, windshield, it's raining a little bit here in San Diego. Nothing too crazy. It's just um, a little bit of rain, which makes the roads wet. It makes the, uh, the freeway, it's obviously more slippery than normal. I'm sure you guys could see the roads are a little bit wet and so i was driving on my way to the gym and i guess there was another car accident up ahead and you know when there's a car accident for some reason everybody stops and they look everybody stops and looks so i'm driving all normal and there was another car accident ahead of me so everybody was stopping to look which obviously meant um a sudden stop in traffic so i'm i'm driving all normal and then before you know it everybody is stopped so i try my best to brake i press my brakes so fast and so hard and obviously when it's raining and um the streets are wet it makes it harder to brake unfortunately since the roads were so slippery when i tried to brake my car just could not brake in time and then since the roads were slippery from the rain it my car like slid it didn't brake and it just slid it was sliding on the road and then boom and it slid into the car in front of me i I hit the car in front of me um obviously it's unfortunate that everybody decided to stop to look at the accident uh, directly ahead so there was there was just a sudden stop in traffic so i ended up hitting the the back of the car that was in front of me every time you hit a car from the back it is your fault um so i stopped with the guy you know i exchanged information gave him uh, insurance my phone number everything because i got i gotta take blame it was my fault i'm taking full blame for this accident i should have been more aware of what's what was going on on the road it, it's my fault as you guys can see obviously as you guys saw my car is pretty fucked up like my car is pretty damaged, but I don't like worrying about materialistic things. Look at me, look at me, I'm okay. I'm in one piece, no injuries, no harm. Look at me, I'm good, I'm fine. And that's all that matters. More importantly, I'm glad that the person I got in the car accident with is okay. He was completely fine, no injuries. You know, he wasn't hurt. So that's all that matters. Whatever happened to my car is fixable. Whatever happened to his car is fixable. But if one of us were to lose our life, that is not fixable. So the most important thing is that I'm okay. I'm still in one piece. And the dude that I got in the car crash with, he's okay. He's still in one piece. You guys might say, oh, but Brandon, it's gonna cost a lot of money to fix your car. Who cares? Who cares? Materialistic things are not what's important in this situation. What's important is that I'm healthy and the dude that I got in a car accident with is also healthy. That's all that matters. And, and we'll worry about the price of the accident and the car damage and we'll worry about that later. Okay guys, so I just pulled up to my house right now and I'm actually really nervous for my mom to see my car because everyone who knows Mama Rug knows that she worries a lot. Um, she gets really worried really easily, so I'm about to show my mom my car and I don't know how she's gonna react. She's actually probably gonna get mad that I'm recording her, but hey, anything for my subscribers, right? Damn, this is actually so crazy. I've never been in a car accident before, never. Mom, can you come outside real quick? I have to show you something. 
you see the dent right there, right in the middle. It's a pretty bad dent. That's right where our cars hit. I got in my first car accident. You're okay. I'm okay, and luckily the person that I hit is okay too. Oh my god. Oh my god. How did it happen? I don't even want to look at him. You're okay. Yes, yes. Thankfully, is... he's okay. He's perfectly fine. Oh my, oh my God. I'm sorry. Oh my God. Oh no, it's okay. Like I said, as long as I'm okay and he's okay, then... Oh my God, this is real. And mom, you know what the worst part is? I braked in time, but the roads were slippery because it had just started raining and my car slid into his car. But I mean, this is pretty damaged all the way through. Starting over here with this end all the way all the way through um yeah it was a it was a pretty pretty bad accident i'm not gonna lie what happened to my car i know you want to play you you brought your toy for me to play is it okay daddy is not really in the mood to play right now you know i just got in a car accident and i'm just i'm, I'm not really in the mood okay but you're so cute so you brought me the toy we'll play you want to play <laughs> You wanna play? Okay, fine. All right, we'll play. He has no idea what just happened this morning with the car accident and everything. Poor innocent dog brought the toy over here. He wants to play with daddy. So uh, we're, we're gonna play with him, okay? Just cause my day got ruined, I'm not gonna ruin my puppy's day, okay? I'll play with you. I'll play with you, okay? Okay. Yeah, look how strong you are, uh-huh. Let's see how strong you are. Can you take the toy? Go, take the toy. Oh yeah, you're so strong. Oh, you found the squeaker? You found the squeaker? Wow, he's strong and he's smart. Good boy. Also guys, me and my brother, we were supposed to hang out today. So I'm about to go to his crib and um, I'll record Rug's reaction to my car um, once I get to his house. Okay guys, so I just pulled up to my brother's house. I told him to step out so he could see this. Dude, I'm actually so like, I still can't believe this happened, bro. I'm low key and like, like a little bit of a shock because this is the first time in my life that I was driving and I got in a car crash. So I'm still in like a little bit of a shock, bro. Like, I, I don't know how to explain it. I just, I don't feel normal right now. Like, I just keep thinking about what happened. I keep thinking about the hit. Like, I just keep thinking about how things could have ended differently for me in that moment. I don't know how to explain it. It might not make sense to you guys because I feel like maybe you had to have been there. I, I don't know, guys. Okay, I just need you to see something. Okay. Okay, you have to take a look at my car. Pro. No. Wait, 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 wait. Who who hit? Who? No. Long story short, there was another accident up front. And you know how everyone Whoa. stops and looks? Are you good? I I'm good. What happened? You know what's stressing me out? I braked in time. But you know how it was raining this morning? My car, like, I hit my brakes. Like, my car just slid into the other car. Yeah, bro. Like, you're 100% good? Yeah, I'm good and the other person's good. Like, his car honestly had nothing, bro. Like, you nothing You realize wrong. how expensive this is going to be? Oh, bro. Now that, like, I make sure you're okay, like, that's that's going to make a dent in your bank account. Oh, yeah. I'm going to have to drop Wait, a bag no, to no, fix no. this. Hey, I'm glad that, like, you're just safe. Because, like, if it was, like, any worse, like, if you are going fast. Yeah. No, and it was when you are coming back from the gym. Going to the gym early in the morning. And you still went? Yeah. Oh, this was a sign to just not even go to the gym. But ball is live. Oh, my God. And then, look, you want to know how bad luck today is? What? I sprained my ankle at the gym. No. But bro, stop. Brian, how scared would you be if like, you see all the traffic coming to a stop and you're you like- try to brake and then it keeps going? Yeah, like I literally hit my brakes and then all the rain, like the wet floor, it just That's like- That's the scariest thing is like driving when it's like wet. Yeah, so it literally slid into his car. 26 years old, my first car accident. Dude, I mean, hopefully you're last as well. Yeah. Hey, bro, with everything that happened this morning with the car accident, you know, things like that really make you look at life through a different perspective, bro. Like, I don't know. I'm just lucky to be alive. Um, like you guys saw, my car is pretty messed up. Like, our cars hit each other really hard. So things could have ended very differently. So I'm just standing here feeling blessed that I'm still in one piece. Because remember, bro, the car, that's fixable. My life, that is not fixable. You can't bring back a life once it's gone. And sadly, car accidents take lives all the time. So I'm just feeling really lucky to still be here in one piece. And with all that being said, man, that's gonna close out today's video. I love you guys so, 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 so much. And my message to you guys before ending this video, please be safe on the road. It has been your boy, Brandon, AKA Bawadis, and I'm out. Peace.